Hail Satan. Hail King. Hail Lord Abaddon. Hail King Asmodeus. Hail King Asmode. Hail Father Satan. Hail King Lucifer. Hail Lord Belial. Hail Lord Leviathan. Hail Lord Pazuzu. Hail Lord Abaddon. Hail beautiful Queen Astaroth. Hail beautiful Queen Lilith. Hail King Azazel. Hail Lord Bilzebub. Hail to every demon that there is in creation. Hail to my 100% brothers and sisters who are 100% true to your path. I love and respect every one of you that is 100% true in Father Satan. I, uh, something's been bothering me for a while. Uh, and I know it's wrong that the person is doing it, okay? It's wrong in Father Satan's eyes. And it's wrong in all of the demonic's eyes, okay? And that person is going to pay for it dearly by the demonic. Father Satan is not going to put up with any of it. He'll put up with it for a while, but then he's going to say, okay, enough. Done. And that person has no idea what she's dealing with. She pretends that she does, but she doesn't. All the stuff she does, everything she says, she hears off of other videos, or she reads it out of, off of other people's, uh, that other people post, okay? Now this lady, I'm not even going to call her a lady, okay? That's how, how much I think about her. She has a group on Facebook, and I'm not even going to say her name. I'm not even going to say the name of the group. Because I ain't going to give her that little tiny bit of notoriety. Okay? Now, new people that are coming to the path, the left-hand path, okay? New people that want to start their path on Satanism, be it theistic, traditional, spiritual, which is pretty much the same thing, or demonologer, uh, they do not want to hear that you can be, this is the kind of stuff that she, this is the kind of crap that she's preaching to be, or not preaching, but she's telling people in her group, in, this is, and I know she's doing it, okay, I'm not in her group, I was, I left, on my own free will, of course, uh, thank Father Satan for the free will part, and King Lucifer, now, with that being said, she's telling people that are trying to learn about Satanism are trying to just eat or just starting out and they're and she's telling people that are just starting out in Satanism and she's even telling people she's even trying to convince people that have been in Satanism for years okay that it is okay for people to be this is a good one okay she's telling people that it's okay if they're Wicca if they're Wiccan, if they practice Wicca, they can practice Satanism, okay? Traditional Satanism. And she's also telling people that if you're a Christian, you can still... Now listen to this one. This is the fucking retarded part, okay? This is the part that gets me more than anything. Because in my honest opinion... And she's telling people that they can be a Christian and still be a Satanist. Now how does that work? You do rituals, what, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and Saturday night, or Friday and Saturday night, just say, you're doing satanic and demonic rituals, and Sunday morning and Sunday night, you're in church. How does that work? How does that even work? It's impossible. There's no way in this world, okay, and I don't care who agrees with me or who don't agree with me. I do know what I'm talking about, okay? I really do. I'm not, I've been on this path for a long time. A very long time. I've been on this path for a long time. And I love it. And I'll be on this path for much, much longer. I love this path. I love being a traditional Satanist. And believe you me, I am 100% to the bone traditional Satanist. Okay? I have been for years and I will be for a long time yet. As long as I'm alive. And then after I die, I'll be with Father Satan and all of the demonic. So then I won't have to worry about it. Okay? But, that being said... She's telling people that you can be you can be anything. She's saying 
You can be anything and be a Satanist. You can be any religion you want. Right hand path religion, that is. Okay, so how does that work? You know, like I said, like I said in previous videos before, there's no way in this world, and I don't care who argues the point or who don't, I know what I'm talking about, that you, any me, any person, can be a Satanist and be on, be on the right-hand path as, at the same time. It's called the left-hand path for a reason. Okay? It's called the occult for a reason. Occult meaning hidden knowledge. And it's called Satanism, traditional Satanism, spiritual Satanism, theistic Satanism, anti-cosmic Satanism, whatever kind of Satanism besides Levan. Because Levan Satanism, now, they don't believe that Father Satan's a deity. They don't believe in any of the demonic. None of them are real. But yet, the thing that gets me about Levan Satanism, okay? And it always has, alright? Ever since the first time I read the Satanic Bible, and then I read, after I had the first time, this is the second Bible I got. I got another one in my on my shelf there that's pretty wore out. This is a new Satanic Bible I got. I got an older one. And this is uh, Satanic Rituals I got. Two of them right here, okay? Now, a lot of people say, and I'll get back to that girl, don't worry. A lot of people say that Anton LaVey did not believe in Satan, okay? Say to that, a lot of people say that Anton LaVey did not believe in Satan and that Anton LaVey did not do any rituals or any of that. Anton LaVey did do rituals. And in my honest opinion, okay, I do believe that first when Anton LaVey started up Church of Satan and the years he had it going for a few years, I do honestly believe that Anton LaVey was a, did do rituals and did believe in the demonic and uh, spiritual realm. Did believe in Father Satan, King Lucifer, Lord Belial, Lord Leviathan, all of them. Every wonderful demon, demoness that there is. Now, if he did not do that, why did he write satanic? Why did he write a book called the Satanic Rituals? Okay, and it's the companion to the Satanic Bible. Why would he write a book called the Satanic Rituals if he did, if he personally did not believe in Father Satan? Why would he do rituals to something he didn't believe in? Okay? But, that being said, I'm just saying that there's no way in this world that you can cross Satanism with any, any right-hand path crap. You can't. It's impossible. It's either you're on the razor blade, it's either you're on the fence, there's no on the fence. There's no sitting on the fence in Satanism. Okay? None. In true Satanism, true statistic, true statistic Satanism, Ave Satanus, Hail Satan. True statistic demonic Satanism, or demonolatry, if you are 100% true on your path to Father Satan, King Lucifer, Lord Belial, Lord Leviathan, beautiful Queen Lilith, King Azazel, Lord Bilzebub, Lord Pazuzu, King Asmodeus, King Asmodee, King A Lord Abaddon, any of the demonic, okay? Lord Samuel, any of them, King Samuel, any of them. If you are true to your path, and if you are 100% Satanist, you know that you can't be two. You can either be a Satan traditional Satanists or a 100% Satanist or you're an atheist or you're a right hand pather one or the other there's no sitting on the fence it's either you are 100% true Satanist or you're not and I'm not joking when I say that I'm dead serious it's either you are 100% Satanist or you're not a Satanist there's no in between and that's like people in the Temple of Satan and people in the Church of Satan. I probably have people that on my friends list that are, but I don't think I do. They they don't believe that Father Satan, or they say, 
They don't believe that Father Satan, they don't believe that there's any such thing as entities. They don't believe in Father Satan. They don't believe in any of the, de any demon at all. They don't believe in Father Satan. King Lucifer, none of them. According to what they say, the temple of Satan, that is, and the same as the church of Satan. So basically, if you don't believe, the way it works is, see, I don't think, I don't think this girl that got that group understands this, eh? The way it works is, either you are a Satanist, true Satanist, either you are a true Satanist, or you're not. That's as simple as it is. Can't get any more simpler. Either you are a Satanist, or you're not a Satanist. And if you're, and if you're, which many people claim they're atheists, that makes, they're not a Satanist if they're an atheist. That's what gets me about the Temple of Satan and the Church of Satan. Why even have Satan's name in there if you don't believe in them? That's making a mockery of them and being hypocrites, 100%. And I don't give a fuck who likes this video or not. I'm just telling you like it is. And as for her, she's trying to tell people that they can be right-hand paths, religious fanatics, whatever the fuck you want, whatever you want to call them, people that are on, are on the right-hand path and in Wicca and stuff like that. Excuse me. Throat's getting dry. She's telling them that it's okay for them to be to be on the right to claim to be on the right hand path and be religious, right? And be a Satanist. Sorry. She is and she is one hundred percent wrong. And I'm not joking, I'm dead serious about this. Cause this is pissing me off for far too long. <clears throat> I am dead serious about this. There is no way in this world a person a person can be a, a, on the right hand path and be a Satanist. There's no such way thing. There's no way that a person can be Wiccan and be a Satanist. It is impossible. Can't be done. And I don't care who the person is. Nobody can do it. And I mean nobody. Nobody on this planet can do it. And I am being dead serious. So every she is teaching people, or helping to teach people, I should say, trying to teach people is a better way. She is putting up videos. She's putting up videos. She's putting up, you know, posts and all that stuff saying it's all good. You can. It's all fine. Just find the light inside of you. Uh, the light inside of you is that little, is that black flame which comes from King Lucifer. Okay, that's the light inside of you. Same light inside of me. The black flame from King Lucifer. He sparked it in me before I was even born. Okay, King Lucifer is my, Lord Satan is my de my father. No question about it. And I can guarantee you right now, anybody that believes that crap that she is spewing, they're heading on a very dangerous road with father with the demonic. And I wouldn't want to be them. So if anybody tries if anybody watches this video and and listens to her crap and believes any of her crap, they are really heading down a very dangerous path when it comes to the the spiritual realm. The spiritual realms, I should say. Uh, they are heading on a very bad path when it comes to that because you cannot do the two. You just can't do it. It's either you are 100%. Father Satan wants you all in. The demonic want you all in. They don't want part of you in. They want all of you in. Especially if you say you're a Satanist. Because if you're a traditional Satanist, spiritual, theistic, anti-cosmic, whatever, whichever, you're either 100% Satanist or you're not Satanist at all. You're either a 100% true Satanist, or you are not. There's no on the fence. There's no sitting on the fence on this one at all. You either are 100% true to Father Satan, or you are not. There's no sitting on the fence. And I'm not being sorry for saying something that's true. Either you are Father Satan's true child, or you're not Lord Satan's true child. And if you're not Lord Satan's true child, why are you in between? There's no in between. 
Anybody that tells you there's in between is leading you astray. And it's a very in and sat traditional Satanism. Another thing right here, traditional Satanism is in a very individual path, and I mean very individual. That's why Satanism is an individual path. Sure, we get advice from people, we learn from each other, and everything else. But when it all comes down to it, and it all comes full circle, it is still just me. And Father Satan and every demon in existence all, who are all of the true ancient gods so if anybody tells you and I don't uh, if anybody watches this video and if anybody tells you oh you can be you can be a right hand you can go to church you can be a right hand pather and be a Satanist or you can be a Wiccan and be a Satanist no you can't I'm sorry you can't or you can be in the new age movement and be a you can be in the New Age movement, but you don't, and you can be a Satanist. No, you can't. Sorry. I'm not even sorry for it, because it's true. It's either you are a Satanist, or you're not. And anybody that tells you you're not, you're, you are, and if you're a right-hand, if you're a right-hand path, if you belong to the right-hand path, and anybody tells you that you can be, do both, don't believe them. Don't believe a word they, she says, not a word. She's a compulsory, compulsory liar, compulsory liar. Number one, and number two, she's not, she's out for attention, which means she's an attention whore. She loves it. And num and I'm not saying this because I don't like the girl. I'm saying this because it's true. And another thing, she's bumming money off people all the time, trying to bum money, asking for money. Same thing as bumming it. Same, no, no difference, really. She's bumming money all the time as well. She thinks she, she thinks she knows it all about Satanism and the left-hand path and all that. Okay, and you learned all this in your 27 years of existence? No, sorry. You didn't. And she thinks because she's female that she can get a lot of the males in if she talk. A lot of males will believe her if she talks sexy and shit like bullshit like that no not me sorry not Johnny John not maggot maggot don't roll that way never have never will the thing is is people and the reason why it's bothering me so much is because people that are new to the left hand path or are just coming on to the left hand path and want to learn about Satanism and if she, they listen to her crap they're gonna be lost they're gonna be confused and eventually, they're going to say, well, what's really the point? There's really no difference than me going to church and doing whatever. Going to, I don't know, right -hand path, some right-hand path church and doing whatever. There's no difference. So either way, I can just say, yeah, I'm a Satanist. So I'm, No, sorry, there's a lot more to being a Satanist than being a true Satanist than just saying you're a Satanist. You have... You have to be in communication with your patron or matron demon, or demoness, that's what I call female demons, who are the true ancient gods. You have to be in contact with Father, you have to be in contact with Father Lucifer, Father Satan, King Lucifer, Lord Belial, all of the demonic. It takes time, you know, you have to study, that's number one. You really have to read up on everything you can about traditional Satanism. Or theistic and spiritual, which is the same thing as traditional, in my opinion. Or demonolatry. You have to study and learn as much as you can. You have to be like a sponge when it goes into the water. The sponge goes into the water first and is dry. But then slowly, then quickly, the sponge, fastly, the sponge starts to absorb and soak in as much water as it can. That has to be you or me or the next person. We have to absorb and soak in as much as we can. And that means a lot of reading. That means a lot of studying. That means listening to people who have been on the path a long time and who are not going to lead you astray. Who are not going to tell you a bunch of lies and you believe it because you think you're, they're telling you the truth. When they're not. 
they're just in it for their own. She's only in it for that late. That girl is. I'm only gonna call her a girl. She's not a lady. She's not old. It's not a woman. She's not a lady. She's, you know, in my opinion, she's just an attention whore, an attention seeker who has serious, very, very. Now, I'm not saying this, this here part. I'm not saying in a bad way, okay? Because <clears throat> I know people that have a lot of very serious psychological issues and problems, okay? Like, I mean, like, really serious. And that lady is delusional, which means she's in psycho, and she's psycho, she's in psychosis. She's been in it now for a while. She won't go to a doctor and get checked because she thinks she's too good for it. But I can guarantee you, it doesn't matter who you are, anybody can become mentally ill, psychologically ill at any moment. Whether it be severe depression, which they used to call uh, manic depression, I think they just call it severe. Dep they call it. Uh, uh, they used to call it a psychotic break, but now it's just severe depression. Uh, severe depression, psychosis, schizophrenia, schizoaffective, bipolar, and schizoaffective is bipolar and schizophrenia together. I do believe this lady has that too. I really do. I'm not joking. I honestly believe that. And I also believe that she is, she's obviously delusional, which means she's probably in psychosis and has been for a while. She really does need to get checked out by a psychiatrist or a psychologist. And if she got checked out by a psychologist, they would send her to a psychiatrist and then or send her to a hospital, psychiatric hospital, and then she would see a psychiatrist, and then she would be get the medication that she needs to straighten her head out a bit. Okay, because I know there's probably a lot of people who are on a lot of who are on psych meds that are Satanists. I'm sure there is, who are true Satanists. But that being said, anything she says, don't believe it. Any new people to the left hand path. Who watch this video if anybody watches it I hope they do but if they don't that's their choice you know I'm just passing information I'm just I I've been I've been start I started these doing videos about three months ago okay not even yeah no maybe two months ago probably three but I doubt it I started doing these videos then because I felt drawn by father Satan and my patron demon to do to do something to help people that, who are new to the left-hand path and to help people out with certain areas, okay? I have a lot of knowledge in the left on say, traditional Satanism and say, the left-hand path in general and demonolatry. I've been in this, on this path a long time. I have a lot of knowledge and wisdom when it comes to it. I'm not bragging about it either because I know a lot of my sisters and brothers who have a lot of knowledge. And I learn from them. I learn from people. Just like everybody else learns from each other. That's what it's all about. We learn from each other. That's the whole purpose. Okay? And the new group and the group men now, there's me and another lady who are the administrators. We're the only two administrators in it. No moderators. Don't need them. Uh, the group's called Satanic, Satanic and Demonic Children. Okay? And with that, you know, we, it's a study group, really, to learn as much as we can, as much as I can, and our people, and me helping people out in the same area, the same time, helping each other out, basically. And I felt led by Father Satan to do it. That's why i done it. And that's why I'm going to continue to do it. I felt led by Father Satan and my, my uh, patron demon. And with that, I'm just going to say, just be careful, man. Be careful what you listen to. Make sure, check it out. Make sure, before you listen, when you listen to it, just check it out to make sure it's true, it's real. And it's not just crap that someone's saying, because anybody at all can do videos on anything. But I, all, a lot of the stuff she is doing, you know, it's not right. It's not right for her to be doing it to begin with. Because she's leading, she's leading people, leading people who, who are new to the left-hand path and that astray, or trying to lead them astray. And I don't even think she realizes that her, well, yeah, she knows the difference. 
I was going to say, I don't think she knows the difference, but she does. She does, and she's getting a kick out of it. She's trying to lead people around like puppets on a string. But no, Father Satan's not going to put up with that. So I wouldn't want to be in her shoes when she has to stand in front of Father Satan or when the demonic come, come a-hunting or the hellhounds come a-hunting. I really would not want to be in her shoes. Actually, that'd be the last place I'd want to be. And that's the truth. And with that, I'm going to let you go. I hope I helped somebody out with this video. I hope so, anyway. I tried. Uh, with that, I'm going to let you go. Ave Satanas. Ave Luis. Have a good night. I had to get ready to hit the hay. Ave Satanas. Ave Lucifera. Ave Lord Belial. Ave Lord Leviathan. Ave Beautiful Queen Lilith. Ave Lord Abaddon. Ave King Asmodeus. Ave King Asmode. Ave King Azazel. Ave Lord Pazuzu. I love every single one of my brothers and sisters 100%. And I wouldn't say something if it wasn't true. I'm not joking. I wouldn't do a video and say stump stuff to lead people astray. I'm doing, I do it because I want to lead people to Father Satan and to the demonic kingdom. That's why I do it. I'm not doing it. I don't get no money for it or anything like that, and I don't want none for it. I'm doing it because I feel led by Father Satan and my patron demon to do it. And with that, I'm going to let you all go, and so you can ponder and think and talk to Father Satan about it and your patron. And I'll let you go. Ave Satanas. I love every one of my true 100% brothers and sisters, and I hope you all have a great night, and I'll talk to you next. Ciao.